Hi, I'm Pastor Rick, Director of Outreach from McLean Bible Church Prince William Campus. And I'm here in our local community today to talk to you about a concept that perhaps you've heard around the church called flipping the script. You see, the people that we minister to uh, have bought into a certain uh, type of belief, a belief that they are dependent on outside sources for their well-being. And if you're like me, when I started ministering here maybe three and a half to four years ago, I was torn. I wanted to help them because they seemed to have less things than me. And so that part of me wanted to give them things, wanted to reach out and be their friend and, and make all the pain go away. And on the other hand, I know that the systems are broken today. And what I mean by that is the welfare systems, the food stamp systems. And so there's a tension there. <clears throat> so what I want to talk to you about today is a principle that God showed us in his word, uh, particularly in Ruth, uh, chapter two, uh, about gleaning. You see, back in biblical times, they had a gleaning principle, which means those who had, those who had things, those who, who were okay, were the, called the harvesters, and they had crops. But Mosaic law did not permit them to harvest all the way to the edge or to the corners, nor were they allowed to go back and harvest again. And the reason for that was because God was uh, portraying his love for both the poor, those who didn't have as much, as well as the principle of work. And that's the reaping principle. You see, those who could not harvest, those who did not have those things, all had to go to work in order to glean what was left. And so this is the kind of principle we're talking about in flipping the script. You see, all of the people that we minister to, whether in the church or in the community, have particular gifts, talents. They have particular uh, contributions that they can make. The problem is they just don't know it. What they've lost sight of is that they are image bearers of God. And though God has been working in this community, just like he's been working in your heart all along since the beginning of time, it's our job to walk with them. It's our job to come alongside of them, not do things for them, but do things with them. Through our brokenness and their brokenness, Jesus can do his work. And so when we come out here, we must be prayerfully, prayerfully equipped in order to come alongside and help these people. Now, whether we're out here doing turkey outreach or the Christmas shop, whether we're on site at our assisted living buildings, uh, working with our senior seniors, uh, whether we're in a, a homeless camps, uh, working with the homeless, what we have to remember is that every single one of these people is an image bearer of the living God. And so in that, as you watch other videos, you're going to hear this concept, this reaping concept, if you will, this flipping the script concept, because we need to replace the lies that they are dependent, that they are worthless, that they're inferior with the truth, that they have inherent worth as creatures of God, just like you and me. So as you uh, join me, we're going to have videos from every ministry. We're gonna have videos and, and, and different uh, uh, types of media in order to try to anchor this concept so that we're not doing harm to these people. And so won't you join me? And we, again, covet your prayers and more than that, more than that we covet you uh, to be in this ministry with us. Thank you and God bless.